Hey Alexa, set a timer for three minutes. Two minutes, starting now. Hey, welcome back inside my cold plunge. Hey Alexa, what's the date? It's Saturday, February 11th. All right, the streak continues. Woo! Hey, today I wanna to talk about real quickly here, I'm only doing three minutes, because I got some things I, got, I wanna take care of this morning, exercise-wise. Um, about how a cold plunge or cold bath can lower your blood pressure. That's some notes here. So I'm gonna read these off. And the health benefits are much more than that, but if you wanna lower your uh, blood pressure, this is one way to do it. This is uh, along the lines of the Wim Hof method. It says here the impact of exposure to cold as well as the Wim Hof uh, breathing techniques strain little muscles in your veins. They close, which I've talked about before, which is called vasodilation, and to keep the heat out of the body. When these little muscles in the veins work properly, there's not much pressure on the heart. A little far away. It doesn't have to pump that hard because the veins do all the work and your blood pressure stays low. Besides that, uh, if you use the Wim Hof practice method, it helps lower your heart rate strengthen your immune system, flush out waste more efficiently, and absorb nutrients and oxygen in your cells more efficiently. Okay, when you're exposed to cold, it strains the little muscles in your veins. They close, called vasoconstriction, to help keep the heat in and fully open, which is called vasodilation, to keep the heat out of your body. That's what I meant to say. And when these little muscles in your veins work properly, there's not a lot of pressure on your heart. I missed a sentence there. It's kind of far away and I'm cold. Um, that's what cold water can do. But there's other ways that you can lower your, your blood pressure in addition to cold water immersion like this. And I've got it at 48 degrees. Uh, lose weight, exercise on a regular basis, uh, eat a healthy diet, reduce sodium, sugar, and salt, limit the intake of alcohol, quit smoking, stop with caffeine, I know it's hard, and do what you can, do what you can to reduce stress. This is also a stress reducer, guaranteed, uh, at least my experience, I, I have very little stress because I, I put myself under difficult conditions like this. As I like to say, if it doesn't challenge you, it doesn't change you. There's a mental resilience along with uh, cold water. If you can handle this, you can handle a lot of things. Anyways, I'm sorry I kind of bumbled through that, but you can lower your blood pressure by doing this because it's scientific on how the vasoconstriction, vasodilation can help your blood vessels. Hey Alexa, stop. And that's just three minutes. Three minutes goes by pretty fast. I'm trying to keep my go neck low. Recommenda recommendation is 10 to 12 minutes a week of cold water immersion. So you can go three times, three minutes, four times a week, and it's all you need. Anyways, that's my little thing here today that I'm gonna share with you during my cold plunge diaries. As always, if you wanna get one of these, I can help you save 150 bucks. Dave 150 at checkout um, at thecoldplunge.com. Immediately take 100, 150 bucks off your cold plunge. Uh, I've got lots of videos on this, so check them out on here on YouTube, and uh, I hope you make it worthwhile and give it a shot. Until next time, I'm Dave. Take care. Adios. Woo. If you want to experience the benefits of cold water immersion or contrast water therapy, use my code Dave150, Dave150 at checkout at thecoldplunge.com. Save $150 off your next purchase. That's Dave150 at thecoldplunge.com.